yeah i said that i just like wanted to to share like something that came to me in the last minutes of the sunset that it's like it's uh, including and not excluding uh, so it was like a felt experience that um, it uh, as it is it's not even uh, seems not even to be a uh, matter on which point of the journey you are uh, considering uh, karma if you want with it as it is with what happens it's uh, sahaja it's like you're not in excluding nothing from the <laughs> experience and then you are one with it and if we are excluding something like this is me and this is my experience we are in the game in the process of, of karma like nothing changes just the experience of what happens it just came to me and i felt like sharing Yes. Thank you. All inclusive human experience, sometimes I call it. I, I our consciousness reveals the same insight to us. Beautiful. That's it and karma or not we are free. in this all-inclusive moment, right? The only uh, thing that like a bit uh, like stays as a question is like for me, maybe some like somehow is the the idea of responsibility it's like uh, because you can say it or or feel it but then when you're in the game you still have uh, some kind of responsibility i don't know it's uh, Or maybe not. <laughs> I'm not sure. But... I I would say you are acting naturally responsibly because you are acting from that totality, from that consciousness, from that oneness. Usually the one who acts irresponsible is the one to believe to be a separate person. Somehow this embodied loving awareness in the expression of that particular avatar
naturally without someone trying to be responsible or to do the right thing seems to find the appropriate action speech for that situation that will be judged by minds based on a mostly still limited perspective so of course there is no truth in that limited perspective but what comes out from that oneness even it may appear not to be so usually is in harmony with the situation. And those very often opposing poles that you are finding yourself, you're still in at home in Israel, right? Yeah. Those impossible opposing two sides that are impossible to solve for the point of view, the conditioned dualistic mind can find from this oneness, from this totality, some form of resolution. When the totality is seen, when from the totality it is seen. And almost never that will be perfect in the game because the nature of the game is to carry some imperfection in the appearance. But the perspective from the totality will see in the imperfection or in the conflict the perfection, the resolution, maybe even the beauty and the love. Thank you.